Plastic surgery is a surgical specialty involving the restoration, reconstruction, or alteration of the human body. According to British Association of Plastic Reconstructive and Aesthetic Surgeons, there are two types of plastic surgery. First, reconstructive surgery. It is done to restore appearance and function to the human body after illness or accident. Secondly, cosmetic surgery. It is done to change the appearance from choice. South Korean parents pay for the children's procedures as a way to congratulate their graduation from high school and entering a university. Statistics show that South Korea is the plastic capital of the world, with Brazil and US trailing behind, according to Business Insider. In fact, getting something done in South Korea is as normal as shopping for new clothes, at least to those who can afford it. There are two hukum for plastic surgery. First, plastic surgery is wajib for reconstructive surgery such as disfigurement, cleft, burn, removal of extra finger or toe, scar caused by accident. This is because this surgery is done as a restoration of the normal appearance to relieve psychological pressure or embarrassment and restore function. These purposes do not involve change of fitra, but restoration of fitra to its state before the injury. Similarly, restorative surgery for deformities due to disease or treatment do not involve change of fitra since they are returning to the normal. Next, plastic surgery can be considered as haram if it is for cosmetic purposes such as lip injection, breast enlargement or reduction, and facelift. This is because there is no urgent need or necessity for them. Rather, the aim is to change and tamper with the creation of Allah for reason of human vanity. In Surah Al-Nisa, verse 119, it was revealed with the meaning, And I will mislead them, and I will arouse in them sinful desires, and I will command them so they will sleep the ears of cattle, and I will command them so they will change the creation of Allah. And whoever takes Satan as an ally instead of Allah has certainly sustained a clear loss. The Prophet wasallam said, Allah has cursed the female who get a tattoo, and the female who tattoo, the female that pluck their eyebrows, and the female who pluck them. The females who file their teeth for beauty and the females who change the creation of Allah. Finally, beauty standards play a big role in this industry which cause normalization of cosmetic surgery. The society tends to see beauty in only a certain way and set a standard such as having a pointy nose, plump lip, Double eyelid eye, sharp chin, and big breasts. It is so crucial to the point some people are bullied and criticized for not fitting in with the standard. This should not be a thing because everyone was born differently and the world will be plain and generic if everyone looks the same. Therefore, we need to educate ourselves and learn to accept our beauty as it is.